My name is Nicole Shanae Bowles. And can I be heard? Am I heard? Yes. 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 First of all, I want to say... I just want people to know just to... Be, before you bash us and you kill us and you just write us off, understand that we are humans people too. And what we are is what we are. Some of us never chose to be this. We were born like this. I was born, when I was born, I never thought of myself being a gay man with another man. I always saw myself, even as a little boy, as a girl, being with a man. And that was hard to do because of stigma, because of family, because of your friends, and just trying to change alone and thinking about what everyone is going to do to you and how your life is going to be affected. And those things happened. And they happened and they're still happening to this day. And that was the 90s and we're in 2019. That's huge. That's huge. So I would ask everyone to just find out more about who we are as people and understand that we are people just like they. Tanya Azapanza Johnson Walker. The magic about being a black trans woman is that we survive. I'm 56 years old. The average age of a trans, black transgender woman is 35 years old before they die from uh, AIDS or murder or suicide or whatever. So I've been resilient and I've resisted the violence and fought. And I'm also an army veteran. That's what makes me, you know, resilient. What brings me joy as a black trans woman is when I see equity in our community. When I see black trans women working in hospitals, black trans women receptionists, work bank tellers, uh, elected officials. Uh, when I see trans women uh, driving cabs or, or, or doing things that ordinary people do. I want trans visibility that way. I want to see them in college. I want them to be the college professor. I want them to be the architect. I want them to be, I want them to be, you know, have any, have every, uh, everything that everyone else takes for granted in society. protected women in this country. We love you. We love you, baby. All these sisters love, I love. Love, love, love. I want you also to know these are the folks you need to reach out to, not just for a hug, not just for a hug, but invest in their lives. If you are someone who has access to resources, these are the women that you need to reach out to. These are not just clients. These are researchers. These are folks who are game changers. And all they are waiting on is for folks in this crowd to reach out to them and uplift them. So we're here fighting for equity as well. And that means making sure we're uplifting black trans women. favorite quote is Zora Neale Hurston and she says if you are in pain and you keep silent they will kill you and say that you enjoy it and that's one of the reasons why we want to uplift black trans women as a black trans woman I understand that it, my life can be taken I can leave this park and my life can be taken Dana Martin say her name Dana, Dana Martin, Martin.